Police department. Oh, oh my. Hi. Hi. Who are you? Hello. Hey. I'm looking for Isaac. Oh, shit. Oh. Uh, okay. I don't know if he's home. Okay. He ran from me on his motorcycle. You want to tell me what's going on? You want to tell me why I'm here? I, I don't know. If you want to lie to me, you can. I don't know. Quick trip has about. phenomenal cameras. Where's your motorcycle at? I can tell you. You've been home all night. Yeah, you know, since like 11. Since 11 p.m.? 11 ish. Alright, what happened to your face? How'd you get all scratched up? I mean, I got this at work at the other day. <laughs> I was down on my looking to hit me a lick. Ready to get into some since I was a jit. I had big dreams of getting rich. Now we leveling up in this Take a look at my kicks. You know we stepping on toughest. The first one to get hit don't make me send a blitz. My head is itching for it. Hollow to spit like a list. But wait. Whoa. Paul and I want the more from the kind deal. Welcome back to Sheldon's Bullet Gas Studio. Where you come to kick it, vibe out, and shoot this shit with Sheldon, man. I appreciate each and every last one of y'all for pulling up. Make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. And I hope each and every last one of y'all having a good day. And if you ain't having a good day, I hope this video or any of my videos relieve a little stress out for you. Anyway, let's go and get up to this video. All right, the title reads, Police surprise man at his doorstep just after he escapes them. <laughs> so imagine your ass done did the dash. You feel me? You done done the race. Done vanished on the police. Next thing you know, you hear boom, 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 boom. You think you good. But you hear that knock at the door. Oh, shit. Hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel, man. Let's go and get up into this video. I'm going to spark up my situation. Make sure you stuff a wet towel up under the door because it's about to get smoky in this bad boy. Let's not waste no more time. Let's go and get up into this video right now. If you ain't fucking with my nigga Sheldon, nigga, fuck you. Yeah. On June 24th, 2023, an officer on routine patrol observed a speeding motorcycle in Holman, Wisconsin. As he followed from a distance, the motorcyclist sped through a parking lot, parked, and entered a gas station. While the rider was inside, the officer ran the temporary plates on the motorcycle, which returned to a 19-year-old male named Isaac. Additionally, it was discovered that Isaac held a restricted motorcycle permit, mandating helmet use and daylight riding. Despite this, he was riding without a helmet well into the night. Minutes later, he left the store and once more sped through the parking lot. Upon initiating a traffic stop, Ask Isaac forward. promptly accelerated once more, reaching a speed of 80 miles per hour. Eventually, Isaac arrived at the road's end, steering into the grassy area. So they already had the chance to run the place. And you run, and you run, and they got your place information. Not only you run, you run home. Like they can't find your information and locate your goddamn address. Goofy. Goofy. Man, if you're going to run, man, you better have somewhere else to run to, especially if they done ran your place. Or if you think they might have had, had the chance to run your place. As a result of this maneuver, the motorcycle spun out and yeeted him off into the abyss, from where he then fled on foot. That man said yeeted. What? That's a real word? Or he just said this? <laughs> end steering into the grassy area as a result of this maneuver the motorcycle spun out and yeeted him off into the abyss from Yeet. where he then fled on foot it's gonna be at 10 50 at the end of viking i got a white male pink t-shirt black pants running into the woods that man ran straight to the woods <laughs> he ain't even chasing Southern after his ass. Minnesota temp tag zero. He's just gonna walk. Two two one. We gonna get you anyway. Yeah, I lit him up. He took off on me, and I got you know he wrecked out on the grass. Everything okay? Yeah, you wanna put that down? Okay. Please, thank you. Everything's good. How you know? To the county unit. You wanna go again? Tell me some. You wanna put that down? Man, listen, there's an intruder who just ran afoot 
on their property and you telling them to put down their weapon, you got some goddamn nerve. What? You don't know what that intruder may do. Oh, I guess since he's lighter skinned, he's not a threat. The fuck? I got my two kids and wife. Okay, I just had someone take off for me. They ran. Exactly. So he protecting his damn castle. And you telling him to put that down. Hell nah, you put yours down, bruh. Into the woods. Okay. If you got it out. Yeah, I have to consider, consider it open. I, I do have weapons. Yeah, Tim Fort. If they want to go west of the scene and try to see if they can locate them over there. You want me to open the camera? I got camera. <coughs> it's working. Um, if you want to, but I should be good. Okay. <laughs> just if your doors are locked, just make sure they stay locked. Thank you. And if you just want to know, reason for the stop was speed, reckless driving, and the RO is does not have a valid license for Class M. He turned up. That's the police jamming. <laughs> I'm gonna have to mute that part of the video. Shit, you gonna give me a copyright strike? Police in that bitch jamming. <laughs> that is not what he was listening to. It cannot be, but it was. Uh, attempted traffic stop on Viking. They got to the well. They took off, got to the end, hit the grass, and driver took off running. Ooh, he pulled that motherfucker out. Looking at license photos, it looks Could like the RL is going to be the rider. Younger male, curly hair, look like a pink shirt, dark colored pants. He ran up in here somewhere. I got to stay with the bike, though, because he took the key. Yep. What's up? You want me to turn the light on the back? Uh, no, we're good. Thank you, though. Okay. I look on the camera. Mm. He ran that way? Did you see him, like, duck down or something? Uh, I knew the camera. In the camera. I do have yep, yep. Open oh, it. I appreciate it. So, uh, let me show you. Yep, I was right behind him. I seen him run up there. I just yeah. didn't know if he, you seen him okay. hunk down. But I'll actually probably grab that camera footage from you if you're going to stay awake. Okay. Thank you. Yeah, okay. He ran up into the woods back that way, but he took the keys with him. So I can't secure the bike. I don't know how he grabbed them so fast. You ain't credit the man for his camera footage? 905's heading your way. I gotta stay with the bike until someone else gets here. So I'm gonna go try to keep up with 905 and see if we can track him down. Tried to light him up back there. He came flying down here, did not realize it was a dead end, hit the wet grass and over, but he took the keys, so there's no way for me to secure the bike. 716-905, where are you at? Several <laughs> other law enforcement agencies arrived and assisted in assisted searching home. for Isaac. However, they were unsuccessful in locating him. <laughs> <laughs> no. All right, move it before I get eaten. <laughs> no, Jack. No, Jack. I you can keep looking. He ain't there. Him even getting the quick trip. No, no. <coughs> <coughs> no. Sorry. No, you're good. Having obtained Isaac's complete information from the license plates, including his address, the officer decided to pay a visit to his residence. What did I tell you? Sir, I got his address. I looked at his picture prior to him going into Quick Trip, and there's gonna be cameras at Quick Trip. I watched him hit that grass. I knew it was a dead end. I was like, you're fucked. He hit that grass, and he's just like, boom. Upon arrival, his mother answered the door and seemed yeah. puzzled by their presence. He didn't tell us shit. Big when I'm in my feelings, I use food for my healing. Food for my healing. It's good for me. Whoa, well, now what it do, good people? It is yours truly, Big Shell. And if you love food like I love food, allow me to introduce to you real quickly Black Girls Grilling, based out of ATL. You understand me? Two black queens whipping up some of the finest cuisines. Black Girls Grilling is family oriented, has a love for food and different cuisines. They come from a line of pit masters. Love to experience different cultures of food such as island, Mexican, and Italian foods. You understand me? Sponsored by Big Green Egg. Black Girls Grilling has won competition after competition, shutting down the competition. So run over to Instagram, see what the hype is about, book them for your next shebang. You know what I'm talking about? Matter of fact, let's run over to Instagram real quick and see what they talking about, cause look, they smoked oxtails and gouda grease. Hmm. Let's see what they talking about. 
Okay. Okay. Season it up real good. Put it on that fire. Got the fire going. Mm. Looking good. <sighs> oh, yeah, they look delectable. I think I might need the. Ooh, so tender. Did you see how it came off the. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I want that. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, uh, so run on over to Instagram at Black Girls Grilling and hit them up. Book them for your next event. Make sure you tell them Sheldon Vibe sent you. But I ain't gonna hold you much more longer. Let's go and get back into this video. Please, Spider-Man. Police department. Oh my. Hi. Hi. Who are you? Hello. Hey. I'm looking for Isaac. Oh shit. Uh. Okay. I don't know if he's home. Okay. He ran for me on his motorcycle. Are you shitting me? No. Oh fuck. All right, pal. All right. She she know he's in there. She's just talking about I don't know if he's home. You was gonna see. You was gonna check with him first about. You know, hey, the police is looking for you. Is there any reason why? <laughs> That's what you was going to say first. But you didn't want to say no, because you know what that leads to. <laughs> What's up, Pooch? No, oh, yeah, he's changed and everything. He's like talking or something. I don't know. Sorry. What's up, buddy? Come outside in your drawers. Boy, gone. This man gonna tell him he was he was home sleep. That's what he gonna say. Mm-hmm. Boy, you ain't slick. He trying to get, look, got his hair all messy. He probably done changed clothes, shirts real quick, I mean, cause he ain't got no clothes on, came outside in your drawers, no socks. <sighs> Playing the part. Hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. <clears throat> Listen, man, I'm sitting on two strikes on this channel right here on the Sheldon Vibes channel on YouTube. So what I need you to do is go to my second, to my alternate YouTube channel, Vibescast TV. Uh, the link will be in the description if you're watching me on YouTube. And if you're not watching me on YouTube, make sure you jump over on YouTube and subscribe to both of my channels, the Sheldon Vibes channel and the Vibescast TV channel. And there'll be another link in the description as well to shooting this shit with Sheldon. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're trying to run it up. Oh God! And make sure you follow me on Facebook, Sheldon Vibes V Y B E Z, no space in between. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, let's keep going, man. He didn't came out here and dressed the part, doing the most. What's going on? You wanna tell me what's going on? What's going on? Why I'm here? I, I don't know. If you wanna lie to me, you can. I don't know. Quick trip has phenomenal cameras. Where's your motorcycle? At? I was just about to say he gonna ask where your motorcycle is. Dang. I couldn't stop it fast enough. I knew it. What motorcycle? What motorcycle? He gonna say, he gonna either say, what motorcycle? Or I don't have a motorcycle. And he gonna lie right there in front of his mama. Cause his mama already know he got one. Or he gonna say somebody must have stole it. Cause I've been here to sleep. He did like, but let's see. All right. You been home all night? Yeah, since like 11. Since 11 p.m.? 11 ish. Alright, what happened to your face? How'd you get all scratched up? I mean, I got this at work at the other day. Alright. I opened the cooler door and it scratched it. Where is your motorcycle at? I don't know. I thought you said it was here. I, I said, I, I said I've been home since like 11. You, I, I heard him come home. Hold on, what did he say when they asked that question? Hang on. You want to tell me what's going on? You want to tell me why I'm here? I, I don't know. If you want to lie to me, you can. I don't know. Quick trip has about. phenomenal cameras. Where's your motorcycle at? I can tell you. Right. I couldn't tell you. Home all night. He said I couldn't tell hey. you. Yeah, I'm just like 11. So I couldn't tell you if you've been home sleep. If you knew your motorcycle was at home the last you saw it, wouldn't you be like it should be outside? Why? What's the matter? Shit, anything wrong with my motorcycle? Mm-hmm. You wouldn't go. <coughs> you wouldn't go straight to. I couldn't tell you. No, nah, that wouldn't be the answer. Mm -mm. You'd be like, shit, it's not outside. It's not parked, or it's in the garage. Like, shh. since eleven 
p.m. Eleven ish. All right. What happened to your face? How'd you get all scratched up? I've been. I got this at work at the other day. Right. right. I opened the cooler. Door. <coughs> he opened the cooler. I don't know. I thought you said it was here. I, I said I, I said I've been home since like eleven. You had, he, I, I, I heard him come home because the dog freaked out. Yeah. Because he came in all hysterical. Eleven. Oh, it was okay. Um, how'd you get home? I just got home. That's my buddy Gavin dropped me off. Can't even say. Buddy Gavin dropped me off. Okay. Huh? How'd you get to Gavin's house? Don't put don't I put your buddy in. Gavin's house. Where are you? He's at my buddy's house. Okay. How'd you get there? Why would you not I ride your motorcycle? Off. You got dropped off. Yeah. You want to be honest with me, or are you just gonna keep lying? I'm telling you. But I was right behind you when you crashed your bike. Right. You left Quick Trip, which has excellent cameras. I watched you go into Quick Trip before you took off. So you want to yeah, be so honest? You watch. Okay, I'll be honest. Okay. What were you thinking? <coughs> I went, okay, so I went over on my I went over to my buddy's house on my bike. Yep. Yep. I, 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 I'm, you know, I just bought the thing. I'm not supposed to be out. Yep. And, I know. And you, you lit me up and you scared the crap out of me. I didn't know what to do. So I just... So give me a break, man. You know, you, you you scared the crap out of me, man. You know, I'm just gonna be honest, man. Can we can we just call it even? No, yeah, it's going to jail, buddy. Ran like literally Look at four his mama. down to his house and I just sat there for an she hour and then I came here. Okay. She's Dude, sick. You realize riding uh, without a license is a ticket? I have a I have a permit. I Yeah, I, I, I know. That's a that's I a really... citation. Do you know what running from the cops is? A big problem. Yeah, mm. I'm aware. It's a felony. Mm. So I'm going to have you turn around and place your hands behind your back for me. You been drinking? No. You smell like alcohol. You're 19? All right. Do you have some shoes and they'll have to change down at the jail? Maybe some shorts or something you could grab for them or some pants? Just give me a minute. All right. Sounds good. Shoes, socks. Uh, just, just does he have some slip-on shoes and then some shorts or pants or yeah, something I'll that he could throw on quick? <coughs> so here's the deal. We have your bike. I don't know what you were thinking. That we weren't going to find you. The plates are on it. I wasn't thinking. You wasn't. That's fair. You are intoxicated. How much have you had to drink tonight, but be honest with me. I had, like, I freaked out. I got home and had, like, three years. After you got home? After. Where are the cans at? Take a deep breath in and blow it like you're blowing a balloon. There you go. That's a Grab good one. He can't. <laughs> hold on, hold on, hold on. That boy quit. He light on his toes, man. He light on his toes like he's supposed. Oh, God. That man said, I had like, I freaked out. I had like three beers once once I got home, after I got home. Okay, that's a good one. Think maybe you weren't thinking because you were drinking prior to? No. All right, I'm going to put these back on, right? You, uh, you need to apologize to your mom. She raised you 19 years, and I'm assuming she raised you better than this? You know, if that's not obvious, I don't know what is. What was that? And if that's not obvious, I don't know what is. You're lucky you didn't kill yourself. You're not wearing a helmet. He didn't apologize. If that's not obvious, I don't know what is. That was your apology. What? Yeah. All right, bud. We're going to go to the passenger side, right? And you still going to want her to bail you out of jail. That's the one that's going to have to bail you out of jail. Her and your, probably your dad, but you know. A little bit further. There you go. It's the weekend. You might be there till Monday. It's a Friday, so he might be there all weekend. Until exactly. the judge sees and maybe they'll give him a bond before that or not. So he'll be able to make phone calls down there. Okay. All right. I appreciate you being so helpful. Do you, do you have, like I asked him, do you have a card or any case information or anything? I can give you the case number. I'm assuming he just First got time to go to jail. I don't know how to write it very well. Nope. And he wasn't supposed to get it in my house. So. Alright, sounds good. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, guys. I get where you're coming from, man, but it was a pretty silly decision. Trust me. If you do it over again, I wouldn't. Hey, what's your name? What's up? What's your name? Charlie. Well, I'm sorry to meet you under these circumstances, but nice to meet you, Charlie. Eh, I used to ride, man. I get it. Bikes are fast, they're fun, but especially when you're learning. Uh, you know, I just bought the thing, I, and uh, I, I guess I don't, 
Well, just I, I don't know why you're trying to pull me over in the first place, but that scared you got me like going like 20 over, and I was scared shitless. I was trying to, I was trying to stop you because I knew you didn't have your license. I have my permit. I know, but you can't ride at night, and you have to wear a helmet. Okay, I know that. I guess. Um, how the hell could you tell them? I'm just curious. They're in your plate. Even if you would have got away, I would have come to your house. Also, it's pretty easy to tell with the way you were riding that you were probably a new rider. Yeah. You were turning on the wrong blinker. You turned on your hazards. <laughs> you used to ride. I had an R6 for a while. Dead man said you were an amateur. <laughs> and then I had a Victory Octane. The 650 is a good starter bike to learn how to you ride. You know what he's talking about, huh? Especially at night, when you're riding out in the country with deer, the deer are really bad right now. It's not even you, there's drunk people out. And I'm assuming you didn't know that was a dead end? Drunk people like himself, and driving. You know, <laughs> yeah, I, didn't know, I did not know it was a dead end, but, you know. I figured unless you were a really good rider, that wet grass was not going to go well for you. Yeah. Don't make you feel any better. He's still on his head about his driving skills. That man said, first he said, I could tell by how you was driving, you was a beginner. <laughs> then that man said, I knew that if you wasn't a good rider, that wet grass wasn't going to be good. Ah, he on his top. <laughs> There's not really any damage on it. Okay. Well, I, I, you know, after all this shit, though, allow you to be able to ride it with all the permit and like it'll be at least a year right he's still trying to ride his damn bike boy you need to get the hell up off of it leave it alone um uh, yeah i know your license is probably gonna get suspended my motorcycle or my drivers i think both I got part of your property. That's kind of <laughs> nice, although I probably don't want it. <laughs> yeah, we're just gonna Jeez, go straight man. in that door, right, bud? Go to the left when we go in. I'm just gonna have you sit down. I gotta type some stuff and then we'll come out, all right? Oh, uh, you got my phone? Where was it? It was in my pocket when I got, when I got in the car. I think it was. I didn't put it in your pocket. Mom grabbed me or something. Uh, I didn't. When I checked you, it wasn't in there, so unless one of the other officers grabbed it. Just sit down for me. Know. I'll check before. All right, I'll check before I leave. Isaac was charged with felony vehicle fleeing eluding an officer and received a load of traffic citations totaling over $1,700. Lastly, he was eventually released on a $1,000 signature bond. Head over to CodeBlueCam.com. <laughs> well... There it is right there, man. As a wise man once said, play stupid games, win stupid prizes. And, uh, yo, he, he earned that. Goofy. He lucky he walked away unharmed and didn't harm anybody else. You feel me? Anyway, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel. Let me know how you feel about this in the comment section below if you vibed all the way out to the end. I really do appreciate you. Make sure you hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel. Until next time, I'm sure the vibes. I'm gonna need y'all to be cool like the other side of the pillow. Stay light on your toes like you suppose. Oh yeah, no. If you ain't fucking with my nigga Sheldon, nigga, fuck you. Yeah. Oh God.